my name is Shaz and this is Shazness Wellness. My channel is all about inspiring individual wellness, always promoting for you to just do you boo. I just like to share my story, keep it real, and I hope you just find some value in my videos. But today is really fun and different um, because I am trying on my very first set of maternity clothing. So I'm currently 25 weeks pregnant and I'm having a little man and I'm so excited. I do have a unique gender reveal video and also uh, like our pregnancy reaction, like me and my fiance Brandon, if you wanna check that out. It was an unexpected miracle baby and we couldn't be happier. Um, there's a lot of things that I need to learn along the way because it wasn't planned. So I just not like I kind of had an idea of what I needed to do. I'm just kind of trekking along and taking it one day at a time. So in this video, I kind of just want to tackle the question, are maternity clothes worth it? Um, so I started to notice probably around 23 weeks that my belly was getting big and I was starting to push out of my normal regular clothes. I would obviously want to go as far as I can without buying any maternity clothes. I wasn't sure if I even needed them. <laughs> I thought maybe I could just buy like larges um, in like at Walmart and just like buy like cheap clothing, but I am noticing that they fit really differently and really exciting. So right now, currently it is Black Friday, Thanksgiving. So a lot of discounts right now. And I kind of get frustrated going in stores and trying things on. I also get frustrated buying things online and then them not fitting the way I planned it to fit. <laughs> but I kind of just took a risk this time and bought my very first set of maternity clothing from Pink Blush. And they have this crazy discount going on right now. So if you're watching this video up to date, you definitely need to take advantage of that. Um, especially for us Canadians, they're offering up to 50% off for shipping. And I just bought a few items that I want to show you today and kind of go through what I like, what I don't like, and is it overall worth it in the end? So I thought it'd be fun to just try it on with you and talk through the items. But before I do that, I want to just show you my regular clothes and how they're fitting right now. So I never wear jeans. I am a fitness and wellness consultant. I wear leggings every day to work and just on my spare time. Even I find a way to even make leggings look cute to go out in. I just I hate jeans. I like to move my legs. I like to be free and yeah, so leggings for the win. Usually I like to buy high-waisted leggings because I like the, the legging to be over my belly button. I just find it most comfortable when I'm working out. I don't like when it rides and I kind of have like a, a, a bum. Yeah, I have a nice bum, <laughs> but it, it slides down and I don't like that. So I usually go for like a higher rise legging. So as you can see at this point, me trying on leggings, it's just, it's really cutting into my circulation and it's really tight on my belly and it's probably not healthy for the baby at all. It gives me this really gross muffin top, top kind of look. Not that it's unattractive, but for me, it's just, it's tight and it's uncomfortable. And when I wear a shirt on top, it just, it just looks like there's this big bump and I, I really don't like it. Um, and in terms of my shirts, um, I, I was always a type of person who liked short shirts. Um, I don't like anything that covered my bum. I just, I usually like to wear high waisted leggings with like a shorter cut shirt. So all of my shirts are, I'm having this problem where I raise my hands up and whoop, there's my belly. So it's really, really hard to fit into my shirts unless they were meant to be oversized really big and for the winter. So I got a few dresses, a robe, like one that you're supposed to, you know, have for the hospital, a pair of leggings and a couple sweaters. So I'm going to start with the dresses. The very first dress I got is this really cute it's almost like a winter vibe dress. I bought it because of the little snowflakes on them. They kind of look like snowflakes. I'm not sure if they are, but I assumed that they were. 
Um, I just thought it fit really well for the season and maybe I can wear it for Christmas. I did get this in a size large and as you can see, it doesn't really fit me too well. It looks a little boxy. It doesn't show off my bump or my curves well, but honestly, comfort is everything and I bought a large on purpose. I didn't want it to be tight. I wanted to be able to move my legs around. It has this great elasticity to it. I didn't need to wear it with a bra. Luckily, I don't have really, really large breasts, even being pregnant, um, so I can kind of get away with it. And it didn't show my nipple through, which was awesome. It's a great length, it's thick, it's kind of double lined and it's warm. So I will probably wear this to like a Christmas party or maybe New Year's, I'm not really sure, but it's super cozy and I'm really happy with this. So the second dress I bought was keeping my baby shower in mind. I wanted something classy and elegant and pretty and also something really long because again, it's winter. I don't want my legs to be cold. I don't wanna wear tights or like, um, what are those called? Pantyhose. Like I don't have time for that. So I wanted to just buy a nice, a cute dress and as much as I love color I'm stickler for my nude colors my whites my grays my blacks um, I think everything I bought today was in that color range except for this dress which was like kudos to me because it had some blue and red in there <laughs> but this dress um, I feel so pretty and I'm really happy with it I love the V cut at the front I love the open chest I love the flary arms and I always make sure whenever I get a dress or a shirt that it's not tight on the armpits. I am a really big sweater in my armpits. It's, it's really bad. Um, I know it's a thing, especially during events. So the last thing I wanted was these yellow ugly pits on this beautiful dress. Um, so yeah, so I like the flowiness at the top. I also really enjoy this elastic band near the midline. It is over the belly, so it doesn't hurt the belly at all, but it gives me a nice figure. It pulls me in and it shows off my belly really nicely, yet still really flowy and elegant. Um, I did notice when I looked really, really close up that you could see my nipples, so I might have to, I don't wanna wear a bra because I don't got time for bras, but I might just wear like little like nipple pads or band-aids or something to make sure that they don't poke through. But overall, I'm really, really happy with this dress. I, the length is perfect. Again, the size I got is large. I got large in all of my items, just in case I forget to mention, large in everything. And just to kind of give you a side note, I usually wear a size medium. Um, when I'm not pregnant and just like my everyday shopping. Okay, so the third thing I got was this robe and I'm so happy with it. It is a robe that you're meant to take with you to the hospital when you're ready to deliver. I cannot get over how soft this material is. It is so cozy. I just want to wear it every day. Um, it's also perfect because it's meant for nursing as well because uh, you can open it up and you can nurse your baby um, as soon as you deliver, which is something like everything I'm learning along the way, guys, I know nothing. I didn't know you breastfed right away. Anyways, learn zing. I like the length. I like that you can tie it up. I have nothing bad to say about it. I also chose one that's a little longer in the arms. Someone mentioned to me that you get a little chilly during pre like during delivery, um, it can be cold, you're like half naked. I don't know, um, but I'm really happy with this. And this is gonna sound gross, but the only thing I'm terrified of is bleeding through it. Um, because obviously once you deliver, there's a lot going on down there and you're gonna have bleeding. Um, I'm obviously gonna make sure I'm padded up really well, but I do stress a little bit that I'll leak on this beautiful gray and white color. So I'm not sure if I should have gone maybe a black, but I love it. No regrets as of right now. Stay tuned. All right, so time for leggings. Now, the material of this, I absolutely love. Um, I do think they're a bit small. And I mean small in terms of the waistline part, like the front I feel very, very comfortable in. It's the back that I feel kind of rides up my bum um, or it's a little too low on the bum, like it's not fully covering my bum. Again, hashtag booty problems, maybe. This is a large, would I have I gone extra large, maybe. I don't even think there was an option 
collection. So I just chose large because that was the biggest size, but they're definitely still wearable. I'm not sure for how long um, because of how big I'll get, but I really like the waistband. It's super soft, it's super comfortable. Um, they are a little thin for winter, but I mean, it's not like they knew I was shopping for winter but I'm really happy with them. I will be wearing them to work. I will be wearing them during workouts now because again, I'm not trying to cut off my circulation, um, but overall I like them. I just don't think they fit me the best. So I'm, this is probably the item I'm least happiest with. Okay, let's talk about my little fuzzy wuzzy sweater bear. I saw this online and it was like an automatic purchase. Like I could not say no to this. It has all of my sweater requirements, a hood, pockets and a zipper like that's it i'm fulfilled um it is as you can see it is so cozy it is so soft my biggest complaint about this is that it it um it leaks that's not the right word <laughs> oh my god it sheds that's probably right it sheds it gets like white fluff everywhere um especially on black like i don't know if you can see but it's kind of all over me just trying to show you maybe it just needs a little wash to get rid of that um but the oversize is perfection the pockets the hood i feel so cute and cozy in this i'm really happy with it i really just don't like the shedding so i'm going to try to wash it and maybe that will help all right, and the last item I wanna talk about is the one that I'm wearing right now. I absolutely love it. Again, all my hoodie requirements. It has a hood and it has pockets and it's big and it's comfy and it still shows off my belly, which I absolutely love. I also love that the sleeves are a little bit bigger. They're not so tight on the wrist. Just gives it a nice cute little sweater look. Um, I just, I can't get enough of pockets. I honestly love pockets. I like to rest my hands there and the best part is I can just like rub my belly as I'm just chilling at work so I really like that aspect as well. Okay, I'm really sad but that's the end of my Black Friday, Cyber Monday, first maternity clothes haul. I hope you enjoyed it. I had so much fun doing it. So I want to go back to my initial question which is are maternity clothes worth it? And my honest answer is yes, I think they are. I know some people who can kind of get away without it. I think it's a fun time to explore your body, feel cute in your body being pregnant and making sure you're buying things that aren't really hard on your belly and just complimenting your belly. And it's a good excuse to go shopping. If you're on a budget like me, take advantage of discount times. Right now, it's this Black Friday, Cyber Monday sale, especially for pink blush. And it goes from November 18th to November 30th, so the end of the month. And this is 2018, if you're watching this sometime in the future. Um, but either way, Pink Blush has really great stuff. They have good stuff for women clothing, maternity clothing, and also baby clothing. So check out their website. It's honestly amazing. I couldn't be happier with my purchases. So all items I showed today were on sale as well. I do want to mention that. And if you want to know exactly what I got, I will link the exact things that I tried on today in the description box below if you want to just click on them and see exactly the clothing that I tried on today. Again, all of them were size large. And I think that's it. I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you so much for watching. I make videos every single Wednesday. So subscribe to my channel. Just tune in. Join this community of people where we can just keep it real, have fun, and spread the love. All right, till next time, XOXO, Shazness Wellness. Bye.